Good morning, good morning, peeps. Happy Saturday. I'm just here having cafe au lait with Menza. And I'm about to go to Pilates and get my workout on. It's day two of my 30-day challenge. And I, I have to tell you, I already feel lighter. I'm, I'm not kidding. I'm not blowing smoke up your... I'm not. Um, it's just like, first of all, when you get your mind right, and then you like do the right things, and you feel the right way, like everything's kind of working together. Anyway, if you're catching the live, say hey. And if you're catching the replay, hashtag replay. Let me know where you're tuning in from. So I titled this, the way you do one thing is the way you do everything. And I don't know if you've heard that saying, or you know what it means, or you don't know what it means. But yesterday I was uh, logging off of work. Now we're, uh, you know, we have a, like a follow the sun. I don't know if you've like heard of that or know what it is. And that just means like we have representatives. We're a global company. So um, that's my full-time job, not my business. Um and so the United States is the last of the Mohicans and we have to kind of like close up shop. So it's me and another colleague. My colleague has been at this organization for years, right? And I don't know what, why he takes this stance, but like we, we support certain platforms like chat messaging and some of them, he's just like, I, I don't do that. I don't support it. I don't know it. And so he just doesn't do it. Like I didn't know it either coming into it. Like, but you know, you learn it, right? And so we, every weekend we have on call uh, rotation and, you know, how we leave Friday night is, you know, indicative of what's going to happen during the weekend. So on one of the computer, I'll just, I'm going to just, you know, make it layman's terms. One of the computers was out of space, right? And so it's like, all right, if you don't do something about it, there's going to be an outage. You know what I mean? Like, and then someone's going to have to be called out of work. And I, I wasn't on call this weekend. And I just kind of got the attitude from him. Like, uh, you know, I don't care. It's not me. I really felt that. And so, I mean, he helped me out, you know, get it sorted. But I thought about, like I said, I'm trying to do this to prevent them to be, you know, from being called out. Like, it's exactly what I'd want someone to do for me or just to do for their fellow colleague or fellow human. Like, you do something to prevent, if you can, you help somebody out, right? And I thought, wow, like, a lot of people have given up hope, you know, with humanity. But look at look at the ratio, Right. And it depends on what you focus on. So like out of two people, one person does the right thing. The other person could give two, give two snaps. So that's 50%. So one out of two people would care about their fellow human. And so I think a lot of times I was talking to a, a new friend on Facebook last night. She's like, I don't have any hope. I lost hope. And I'm like, you really, you have to redirect, right? Like you have to redirect what your attention is. Do you focus on the person that's good? Do you focus on the people who are doing the right thing, standing up for people's rights, standing up for freedom, or do you focus on the cl the black cloud of negativity? It really it really depends on where you put your focus. Like I put my focus on on the good. So rounding this back, if this resonates, please let me know. Drop like humanity or human or yes or drop something so that I know what I am saying is <laughs> being heard. Um, because the thing is. You know, everyone says, like, treat somebody the way you want to be treated. But, like, do they? You know? When somebody is nasty, people are like, well, I'm going to be na I'm gonna be nasty. They get, you're going to get what you give. That, mm, you know what I mean? It's always, it's, it's a little bit different when you rise above. Hey, listen, I am all boundaries, right? 100% you should have boundaries. Like, 100. You should know where, who you are and what you're going to tolerate and what you're not. Absolutely. But doing what someone else is doing, if they're wrong and you think they're wrong and then you like lower yourself down to that, what are you doing? So how you do one thing. So the way I am at work, like work, my full-time job is a very, although it, it, you know, it's a large part of my life. It's a very small part of my life. But the way I behave there is the way I behave at home with my family, with my friends. It's not always convenient to do the right thing. It's not always fun to do the right thing, but it's always rewarding and always feels like very fulfilling to do the right thing. So I just wanted to share that with you. If you're going through something, I know everyone's going through something right now. Um, it's stressful. So if you're going through something, you know, raise your hand. Know that, you know, I'm here for you. People are here for you. Um, you're not alone. Like that's the biggest takeaway I've gotten from this whole thing. I posted last night for Celebration Friday. 
you know, going through like CB19, I had moved from Manhattan to Brooklyn by myself. I was very like lonely and I was like in this new place, in this new borough by myself, locked in this apartment, was scared to even open the window because that's when everything was cray cray and everything was so, you're so isolated and alone that I was just really blessed to have a community around me to support one another in this business. That's what I was posting about, like how grateful I am. Like everyone posts about, you know, their business, join me, the product. Oh, it's the best thing. But what about like outside of money that people have one another, the support? I mean, it's seeing my team post about all the benefits they get from this business outside of money and being a better person. I think we can all use a little bit of self-development on some level. I don't know where you are, but um, there's room for growth and there's people that are there to support you. So don't lose hope. You got this. Have a wonderful Saturday. If you got value, please drop value. And I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Ciao, ciao.